One of the best track, uh, back stretches that you can do is what I call the towel pull. And we call it towel pull because we're using a towel. The reason I like to use a towel is because if I grab the person that we're stretching by the wrist, I'm in control. And if he has pain and I don't sense it, then I, there's nothing he can do about it. But if we use a towel and we're pulling and uh, he has pain in his back, all he has to do is let the towel slide through his hand. So the towel works very well for this activity. Uh, secondly, when you uh, have a, choose a partner, get someone that is uh, very understanding because if you get someone that's going to pull too hard rather than help stretch you, they can cause injury. So at this point, I'm going to ask Bill to come over and be my person with some low back pain, and he will, I will perform the exercise with him. We're going to start with just some mild stretches, almost just rocking movement. And then Bill's going to walk back. back and forth to scoring a little farther each time. And anytime he would feel pain, then he's going to stop and I'm going to allow him to pull back up. As we continue to go farther in terms of the range of motion, here's the flexion. And now he goes back with extension. He wants to roll back on the table. So in his low back hits first, and then he rolls back out until he's completely lying on the table. And then he rolls up. What I want to do is I want to feel Bill's stretch. If he pulls lighter, then I'm going to give him less resistance. If he were to pull a little harder, I'm going to give him slightly more resistance. But we're always going to go at about this speed. So I judge my resistance by what it takes to go at about this speed that you see. And about five repetitions is good to start, working up to about ten repetitions over a period of time. Thank you.